Hi, and welcome back to this week's Pet of the Week. We're here at the Kokomo Humane Society with a very sweet little dog named Snooky. And Karen's going to tell us about her. She's a little on the thin side. Um, tell yeah, she's one of our, our sad stories. She came in with another dog. Um, another dog that no, she's actually put on about five pounds since she's been here really emaciated and um, not in good shape but super friendly and um, we've been feeding her she loves the treats she's about six months old she's gonna uh, a boxer mix she's got huge feet she'll probably get a little bigger um, her you know she might even though at around six months they start to slow down she's real thin so she's gonna probably get bigger than she is now but she's a really nice dog she sits she de lays down um, real friendly gentle um, but She's sort of a, a, a sad story, the way she came in, but she seems to be pretty happy. One that comes here and is really happy to be here because she's right. getting fed. Right. <laughs> so um, she's up for adoption, and um, she'd be a great family pet. I think she'd be good with kids. She's real gentle, sweet, very food motivated. She'd be easy to train. Yeah, you're a good girl. So, <laughs> you want to talk into the microphone? Tell them how good that treat is. <laughs> mm. <laughs> and she is very uh, cautious and she's not going to bowl you over. No. She even, I mean, like she might lift her front paws up, but it, you can tell it registers her, with her that she might be doing something she's not supposed to. And it, she had to motivate her with treats earlier to get her to get up on her lap like that <laughs> because she even questioned fine. that. <laughs> yeah. Um, her adoption fee will be 120. She hasn't been spayed yet, and um, she'll be spayed, and she's been vaccinated, and she'll be microchipped. But um, she's a good dog, nice dog. Right. Someone who's looking for a little larger dog and young. She looks, she looks like she's full grown, but she's still really puppy because she's only about six months old. <laughs> yep, she's a good girl. <laughs> she is, and. You know, being a sad story, she doesn't look sad or appear no. to be sad. Like you said, she's definitely glad to be here, and she would be even more, <laughs> even more happy to have a home. Come on. <laughs> There's a little craziness going on in the kennels behind us. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, what is going on? Are you guys going to be anywhere anytime soon um, and I know your open house is coming house. up. We're, we're going to be actually at Rural King for the next every Saturday between now and Christmas ringing the bell and we'll have an adoptable dog there actually Larry is, is scheduled to go there on Saturday that we had before and um, so there'll be um, someone there each Saturday and um, then we have our open house and that's what we're sort of focused on right now. We've been talking every week if there were going to be adoption specials. The adoption special for the um, open house will be any cat that is previously altered is usually $20. We're going to have those um, a special for $10 adoption fee. You will be responsible for the uh, rabies, but the cat itself will be $10. Um, Purdue is coming. Come here. Come on. There's Come on, girl. going on, isn't there? Purdue is going to be coming on... Um, the 11th, and so we're planning on having an adoption special after okay. after they come. But and we'll have kittens then that are in foster that are going to be ready to be adopted after the 11th. So uh, for the open house, basically come and get your pet, your pet and yourselves taken a picture taken with Santa. And we're going to have raffles. We've got lots of prizes stashed away, and so everyone who comes in will get a raffle ticket, and then we'll be pulling um, uh, tickets for raffle prizes. And we'll have lots of treats. One of um, our generous donors is bringing all the treats for Saturday. She asked if um, 15 dozen was enough. I thought that would do. Uh -huh. So, um, and then there'll be uh, animals available for adoption. Snooky will be here on Saturday, unless she gets adopted before then. But there, we have some nice dogs. We did have um, a shelter come and pull dogs from us. And so we're a little light a little lighter than we usually are which is a good thing but we get dogs in every day and we always have lots of cats and we will have the kittens the following week, um, week. but uh, things are good she's got a nice big voice if someone wants yes. a dog that's going to bark your voice is much bigger than you are <laughs> it's okay 
Oh, and I guess um, I'm trying to okay. think when we'll be. We'll, we'll be at the winter market again on the 13th of December. Okay. Okay. And the open house is this coming Saturday. Saturday. From 12 to 3, um, Santa will be here for pictures. And then um, we'll still be open until 5, but he'll be here until 3. And that's Saturday, December 6th. 6th. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh -huh. okay. At 713 North Elizabeth. Okay. All right. <laughs> Unless Mike takes this dog home. <laughs> <laughs> He's yes. got a friend. <laughs> Sitting back there with the cameraman. Pretty happy. <laughs> Okay, so this has been Pet of the Week. Come out, see Snooky, or just come to the open house and have your pets or your picture taken with Santa. It'll be a great time. And as we always say, there's no guarantee that Snooky will be here, but there's always someone waiting for their forever home. <laughs>